What is up? My name is Ian and I help people take their mindset from a place of lack to a place of abundance. A while back, I uh, made up this, uh, this motto and it was really simple. Build a body, build a business. Because I figured if I could build a body, if I could work on myself, if I could build a muscle and if I could get stronger and better and face the resistance and actually achieve results and then I'd figure that I could probably do the same thing with the business uh, whether that's you know creating you know a YouTube channel or getting around multi-millionaires and learning how to change the, the way that I make money so it works for me and I've come to realize that the, the principles of working out and building residual incomes are very similar I think the, the first step is patience. You know, you do not get results after working out at the gym for two hours a month. No, you 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 gotta work every single day. You gotta work out every single day. You gotta improve yourself every single day. And eventually you'll start to see minute results. And you keep on building that momentum of working out all the time and uh, consistent every single day. Eventually, you're gonna see tremendous results where like, you are a totally different person. So number one is building a body and building a business takes a long set mindset, a long term mindset. And the fact of the matter is, if you did accomplish what you want um, right off the bat in less than a few attempts, then we'd all be multimillionaires. But the fact of the matter is working out and that daily discipline of building yourself and building your mindset and building consistency, that's what builds momentum. If you do it one time or a few times, that doesn't build momentum. Momentum is what pushes you forward and that leads to the second step. You know, if you can build a muscle group or you can build a sort of asset or maybe just one asset that can lead you to another. So when I talk about momentum, I'm talking about you're bringing all the skills, all the, the discipline and all the self confidence that you have previously into whatever you're working out right now. So let's say that you wanted to build your chest. So you're working out your chest. You're really focused on building your chest. Bam, you have a nice chest. Okay, now that you have a nice chest, all right, maybe it's time to get nice legs. So you start doing legs and you take all the discipline and all that, the same mindset and just use that to your legs. So in business standards, like build one asset, work really hard to build that one stream of income. And once you build that, you can actually start to look at other residual incomes or other businesses or whatever it may be take the same mindset, the same discipline and skill set and build another stream of income. So it, it all kind of com comes full circle. And I think the, the, the third one would totally be main maintenance. Because when you, when you get to a level of like you're pretty, you're in pretty good shape and you're not necessarily plateauing, but you're just getting to a point where let's say you don't have like a gym partner and um, you don't have uh, anybody to spot you necessarily well that muscle that you that you gained can be easily maintained um, you probably don't expect to get you know huge results and get huge muscle muscle mass um, rapidly but you know maintaining it is actually gonna be a lot easier than all the previous work that you've done to get to that point. And that's what I kind of feel like with when it comes to business is, you know, when people retire from business, they're not retiring from the building of their asset. They're retiring from uh, obviously a job, but they're retiring from the hard, you know, the hard, I'm not going to say it's not hard work, 
maintaining it. But I'm saying it's like, it's a different type of work than maintaining. Um, and that's just, that's just when it comes to a point where you're building a substantial amount of wealth, it just maintaining it is going to be a lot easier, obviously, than that come up that two to three, two to five, two to 10 years as you build yourself and build that business. So if you haven't noticed already, building a body and building a business are very similar. And I highly encourage you to you know, get in shape, go to a gym, get a gym membership, start running, start doing something athletic. And I'm going to guarantee you that if you start seeing results, it's going to be addicting. And if you can continue to build results and build that momentum for yourself, you're going to get to a point where, you know, if you can build a body, you could build a business. So hopefully you guys like this video. Thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, go ahead and hit that like button. If you want to see more videos like this, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. But other than that, I hope you have a beautiful day and I'll catch you later. Namaste.